Hello farmers, welcome to Jolly Farm, a farm where I practice organic farming and today I'll be taking you through about our farming which is Azola farming as Azola has been researched and proven and known for its rich content in proteins which help your, your animals to grow fast with about 15 to 30 percent production rate improvement so here I'll be taking you about Azola farming, its importance, how you can plant, how you can harvest, and how you can feed to, our anim to your animals. Also how you will end up getting more profits and more, more outcome from your animals. These are Azola you can use to feed to your pigs, you can feed to cows, and also you can feed to your poultry. So for our case here on our farm, we mostly use Azola to feed on to our pigs and our poultry. So here I'll be taking you how you can construct our, your pot, how you can get your seed, and how you can plant your Azola and how much time you require for you to start harvesting your Azola. As Azola planting and harvesting is just simple and you will and in like about seven days you will be ready to harvest things so with me here i have my three ponds here prepared ready to plant here my seeds and as you can see here i also have my seeds ready here to plant so i'll be taking you through a small procedure how you can construct this pond so first for you to construct a pond like this mine you first need to have a liner which will hold water have something anything it must not be a liner anything which can hold water for a long time not not waste so you must have a liner and a small space for you to construct your pond so first for me here i began by digging my hole dig of any dimension according to the size of your liner which you have after you have dug your hole clear all the sharp objects in to the hole to prevent them from destroying your liner so after you have constructed you, you are you have put into the pond your liner like mine here as you can see first you have to fill your pond with water fill it to almost half don't fill it to full to prevent it from overflowing so after you have put the water into your pond your water needs you you need to add manure into your pond Manure will help your Azola plant to grow faster and to manure at the required time possible. So after you have added manure into the water and the pond is full of water, planting is just, just simple. After you have bought your seeds, as for our case we have our seed on our farm, you just have to distribute the seed evenly on top of water. Make sure that the seed occupies about 30% of the pond or the surface of the water. As a solar matures faster, like in 48 hours, the Azola, Azola will be have germinated like double. If you put 30%, after 48 hours will come, your Azola will be filled about 60%. So, harvesting is done after every 7 days according to the, to the manure content and the, the service you give to your opponent. Make sure you maintain your pond, like you check it like after every two days, you come and remove some, maybe there is weeds falling into the pond, so pond management is most important. So you check your pond every day, check about the water, check if there is some leakages, and also check if your pond requires more manure. So here I'll be showing you how I clean my seeds. Here as you can see the ponds are ready, filled with water. And manure. So planting is just simple. Here is my seeds as you can see. So if you require to plant, you just have to dig it like that on top of water as I am doing here. Just like about 30%. I think that is enough. Here is my second pond. I just dispute my seed evenly. That is enough. Well, I expect in the next eight days I'll be harvesting 
and each day I'll be coming here to check the progress. So here is just the simple process as you can see I have planted my azola seeds and in the next like seven days I'll be harvesting. So here is my doing well. Uh, these are the ponds I planted two days ago. All doing well. Here as you can see the pond is doing well. This one also I need to plant as I prepared it today. So just planting my seed to distribute the Thirty percent. So that was just a small view how you can plant your solar and the benefits as it's an alternative for protein to your animals and your production will be good as the production per day is about fifteen to thirty percent. So after you have planted your azola like this one, this is now seven days ready to harvest. So harvesting you just harvest like thirty percent. Like Seventy percent, then you leave thirty percent into the water for continual regeneration. Thank you for watching. That was just a small view of how you can plant a solar and how it will benefit you with much proteins to your animals with much and bulk outcome. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more updates that are coming up. Thank you for watching. All you are welcome to Jolly Farm.